Hey, welcome back everybody to Madden 18 Dolphins Fantasy Draft Franchise. As here we are now at week 7, as last week we went on against the still winless Falcons and we defeated them 30-7, to but we did take on, of course, a few more injuries, Taylor Gabriel being one of them, as we've lost him for about the next four weeks with a dislocated elbow. The good news is we're still doing well. And so anyways, we are 6-0. and oh. We are officially the only remaining undefeated team, as well as we have officially taken the lead in the division if the Jets beat the Patriots. And speaking of the Jets, it's time for us to play them for the second time. The, the, the second time this season, as you know, in the division, you play there with your opponents twice. So, so far throughout, since we're getting close to halfway, so let's take a look. We remember the Buccaneers, that was an unbelievable game. The Chargers was one that came down to the wire. We won the game because they had a penalty called back. The first meeting with the Jets was crazy. We won that game thanks to uh, my, my, my hit stick, so that was pretty intense. The Saints was a laugher. The Titans was one of the craziest games ever. It didn't save, so I had to force a win. You should go watch the video, and you'll see. And the Falcons was a laugher. It was 30-7, to so... So, anyways, it's time for us to match up with the Jets for the second time. As Crabtree and Co. have returned as our team's up to 86 overall, and so is there. So, hopefully, we'll be reaching 7 and 0 by the time to the end of this episode. And if we win this one, we'll officially get our regular see, uh, we get our uh, exp meet our expectations for the season. Because in case you don't remember, first for uh, four episodes we did uh, preseason, and we went zero and four in the preseason. Just, okay, just in case you know, you skipped all the way here and watched that, <clears> that <throat> we went uh, zero and four in the preseason. So I, our expectations were not high. They should be now because we're six and zero, and the jet they are four and two. So. I don't think New York has lost since we played them. I don't know. That might have actually they might have had two losses when we played them. I don't think they did. If not, they've been they've been on fire since we beat them. That clutch victory and we whenever I had TJ McDonald hit stick Chris Hogan. I probably remember that. Like, oh they're so close. Of course, you know, they would have scored a touchdown and would have just tied the game unless they would have went for two. So it's not like if they would have scored, we would have lost the game. We would have tied the game. Probably would have to go to overtime. Oh, we are the least scored on team in the league. We have a seven score, a plus seven scoring differential. It's not really that good. If you're six and oh, that's not really that good. Figuring we played a lot of close games, it's, it kind of explains why. All right, then time to get rolling. Third down there at the 45. Third and 12. It's actually been a while. So, yeah, I'm not actually sick anymore, so that is awesome. And we can finally move on and get to the next series. Well, that didn't turn out too well. Ready right, to get ready to head on to the next rotation, which is really good. Yeah, our defense does need some help here. Set third and four. Dang, New Orleans is 0-5. They've not won a game. I was looking on the bright side. Neither has Atlanta. I tried to hit stick him again. You know, like freaking from now on, TJ McDonald is my hit stick guy. That is he is unbelievable. Yeah, back it up. <coughs> Notable, guys. Well, the good news is, after this game, we get Terrell Suggs and uh, and Lamar Miller back. So that that's awesome. So that that's, uh, that's a key piece on offense and defense that we're getting back. So that's something that we really need. Dang, actually, I thought he got it, man. I don't think he was at the two, man. He was, like, right there, bro. 
But I ain't complaining as long as he's in school. <laughs> Oh, dang it. Ah, uh, he got lucky. He just slipped out of our grass. Yo, they missed the PAT. We blocked it. Hold on. Let's see here. What happened? Game stats. All right. Scoring summary. You know, he just missed the kick. <laughs> nice. Ball here, yeah, a little bit. So yeah, we are without you know Taylor Gabriel for about a month. So Zay Jones moves officially out of the slot, and Juju's now our number one receiver, which you know he actually is that now. Red zone alert. Right of the one, and it is freaking second and inches at the one yard line. That's a little gay. Well, that didn't work. It's worthless. It's very hard to run the ball, and I don't know why. Like, you know, it's just goal line. I literally just asked, why is it so hard? But gee, a lot of reasons. It's already the second quarter. I just don't notice. Oh, touchdown. Very, very nice. Sick this. This was nice. I thought I was going to get sacked. I really did. I thought he was going to grab me and do so. I said, no, get off of me. I'm scoring. Very nice, Connor. Your axe turning to be pretty good. Or he's turning out to be pretty freaking useful. Preseason, he was like trash. But to be honest with you, he's he's turned out to be a pretty good backup quarterback. His axe turned out to be pretty darn useful, I'm not gonna lie. He really is. Zay Jones! Getting our man some respect around him. Red zone alert. First and 10. At the 20. Dang it, I tried to spin away. I waited too long and hit the button. Let's see here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, let's just call it time out. At the one. Dang it, Zach, you almost made it. Touchdown. Andrew West already has six touchdowns. How many did, like, you know, Lamar Miller have? I don't think he had a lot. Oh, wait. Man, Crabtree's not even playing. He's hurt, I think. Let's see here. A medical report. Jets, yeah. He's not even playing. Well, great. Now it means I have to change the title of the episode. Well, that's not good. I literally, that means I literally get a chance to score right quick. You scumbags. Hold on, this thing is getting freaking retarded on me.
because I can feel it. it's very unorganized. I think it said that and Chris Hogan were hurt. Isn't that, is that what that said? Were they were both hurt? What's up, Nick? Yeah, they're literally down. They're two, two of their receivers. That is quite unfortunate, really. But hey, you know, it's 14 to 9. Just hit the field goal. Oh my gosh, we saw him go right down the field on us. Got hurt. Oh, their running back got hurt. So Jed shaking up. I'm not complaining. I don't. I do not support players. Getting, I do not support players getting hurt. I do not support that. So they have Theo Riddick in there now. I swear, sometimes I think the CPU is actually retarded. I really do. Well, they just took the lead. It's 15-14. Oh, sweet. Okay, I think we just, we just scored, but um, I don't... I think we just missed another kick. You guys remember that from the first one? Why do I keep going to injury report? Okay, that chart, game stats, scoring summary. I went too far. I don't know what I'm doing. No, it got blocked. Oh, shoot. Why in the world did I call that? You know what? No, let's just risk it. Why is Darius Slay in a slot? It's just like, why is he in the freaking slot, dude? He's not supposed to be our slot corner. He's not our, he's not the nickel back now. Just tells the game. You do know he's like, he's not our nickel back, by the way. Get that out of here. Dang it, Dion. You should have had that. It really would have been a great time for our first pick. We're trying to hold on to a five-point lead here. What the frick? Okay, that was a little weird. Picked off! Jimmy Smith. I knew for the moment he lobbed that up. I said, I, I got to come down with this. Got to come down with this. And yo, we did. I mean, that was that was a horrible throw. I don't know why did he throw that? Wow, we cannot see nothing. All we see is blue. Third down alert, gamers. Third and nine. Dang, I just want to lob it up. I kind of just want to lob it up here. I'm gonna do it. Going deep for Zay. Wow, he missed it. It's on the line here. Wow, good punt, noob.
Ah, oh, dang it. What the frick? Why is the camera halfway like just looking elsewhere? Why, why are we throwing him forward? What are you doing? Why are you, they just so easily moving down the field? Like why why is it so hard? Is this a, why is this hard? Just look at him. It's just like why? Why is it so hard, guys? Come on. I was about to say, bro, if we don't get him. It's a loss of 11. Third and 11. We got to hold up here. Oh my gosh. Was like, we really? We, no way are we going to We can lose this game. Is there? Oh yes, yes there is. <laughs> Absolutely. I don't know exactly who I was talking to right there, but I think you get the point. We just don't need nobody getting hurt. So that way we don't waste any time out because they got to get a touchdown. Okay, that was horrible. Well, you guys are actual ass. You guys actually suck. Okay, all we need is a field goal. And what in the world are these plays? These are god-awful plays. Why do you have to get the worst plays ever? Holy crap. Boy, we got a minute 22. There's really no need to fret about this. I just don't need to force anything. It's not there. Don't do it. Oh, he caught it. All right, let's see here. Don't need, don't need to throw no stupid pass here. Don't need to do nothing stupid. All right, call a timeout here. I mean, we can go now. We can either get a field goal or try to go for the win here, but we don't want to do nothing stupid. So, because we lose the ball, it's game over. Oh, look at all oh, there. Still, I swear to you, this man is going off right now. I'm loving this because he's really shown that he's really beginning to come on. Oh, Juju again. Okay, we're going to run the ball and we're going to call a timeout. That's what we're going to do. Okay. Timeout. That was a waste of a play. We didn't get anything. No, I really actually want to try to score. I really do. I want I want a touchdown. I want to try to end this down. I don't want to go to overtime again. We might lose this time. Nick, get out of the way, dude. I'm, I'm trying to concentrate here, dadgummit. Okay, we might have to like freaking like get a field goal. All right, all right, we'll just go. We'll just go to tie the game. <sighs> oh my god, dude! I want to really try something, right? You know what? You know what?
screw it. I mean, let's. Wow, and we have one second left. Okay, yeah, we're going for field goal now. What kind of throw was that? Seriously, you're going to choke under pressure? Are you kidding me? I mean, really? He blocked his. I was about to say, he just blocked him calling so much bull, dude. Another overtime game. So we are tied at 23. You know, Connor Cook would know how to freaking just throw the ball. We wouldn't really be in this situation right now. We've won the toss. We want to receive because obviously it's overtime and you get a touchdown, you win the game. Came away with a score. We need a score. Okay, let's just go back. All right, guys. Another OT game. I'm actually a little nervous this time because now I feel like we're probably not going to win the game. And that's probably why, because I just made the dumbest throw I'll ever make in my life. Oh, well, yep, oh, okay, yep, yep, okay, we lost, okay, 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 okay. Oh my god, I knew we should have went for it. I freaking, I blame Connor Cook. I blame Connor Cook, I blame Connor Cook, but you know what? Who cares? We used to have the division lead. Oh my god, <laughs> Okay, yeah, we done lost. This is ridiculous. I mean, because they, they, they gave up. They gave up. I can't believe that. They, we actually gave up. I can't believe they just, they're just going to give up. They're just going to just pound the rock on. Who? Oh. I don't know. Whatever. I don't actually end the fight. What? I don't think I've actually seen that. So, well, there we go. Lost our first game, but they can't win them all. As usual, we're going to look through the stats. Connor Cook is trapped. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. No, 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 no. Okay, so he went 23 for 31. 266 yards. Touchdown. Two interceptions. Tricandrick West, 22 rushes, 77 yards, and a touchdown. Connor Cook, two rushes, six yards, a touchdown. Zay Jones, one rush, four yards. Dardarius Stewart, seven receptions, 92 yards, and a touchdown. Tricandrick West, four receptions, 41 yards. See Zach Ertz, four receptions, 38 yards. Zay Jones, four receptions, 55 yards. Juju had four receptions, 50 yards. Et cetera, et cetera. Let's see. I kind of knew we were going to do something stupid in this game, but I mean, it was bound to happen. It was, it was bound to happen. It was bound to happen. It was a good game. It was a good game. My defense, well, not really. You really didn't play that well. Had a lead. We blew it, et cetera, et cetera. I mean, there's a lot of issues here. To be honest with you, I really don't think the defense actually played that well. I mean, they, they blew a lead. I'm kind of put this one on the D because they kind of blew it. Because they had, they had a, it was a 13, because he's kind of right. It was a 13 point game, I think, at one point. And uh, we kind of we kind of blew it, so so we kind of blew it. So our top offensive burners: Juju, Kendrick West, Connor Cook, our Darius Stewart, and Zach Ertz. Top defenders: Marquise Flowers, Jimmy Smith, Darius Slay, Deion Jones, and T.J. McDonald. So the well, the good news is that we're getting we're getting Lamar Miller and Terrell Suggs back. Finally, so that's those are two key parts that we're getting back to our team. 
<clears throat> that we really, really. <laughs> All right, let's see here. What about you? contract length is good. That's about it. Okay, we can create this for you. Yes, so Terrell Suggs is back. So is Lamar Miller. So that just that's even better. So it's a shame. Marquise Flowers was actually doing a good job. Actually, he was doing really good. We still have well, we still have the division lead because the Patriots also lost. So even though we did suffer our first loss of the season, we. I have no need to panic whatsoever because we're still six and one. There's there's no need to panic. We're still in good shape. You know, we're just you know, all still hit by injuries. We're gonna be taking on a three and four Baltimore team. It's actually a Thursday night game, so we are technically the first team to go. So let's see. The good news is we didn't so the good news is no no nobody got hurt this game. So that that that's that is a pause that we can take out of this. So we just so Carson Palmer will be back for five weeks. We'll actually get him back before we get Carl Lawson back. So the game will be back in three weeks. But anyways, that's gonna go ahead and wrap up this episode. So hopefully next game we're gonna be able to rebound from our first loss of the season. The wait and see. But anyways. Wait, what? What's going on? That gummit, dude, I can't see. Yeah, that man's old as dirt, though. I just killed my mood. I don't even know how I want to end off this video now after seeing that. I wish I could rotate this so you guys could see my react. <gasps> yes. Right. I, th I thought we were rotating. Yeah, see, that was that was terrible. Did we, die? Did we really just pick up Ryan Fitzpatrick? Are you serious? Really? You know what? That's it. We're done. I'll, I'll, <laughs> we're done. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out, guys.